this is a really random question that I'm just throwing at you here. So forgive me for this. In terms of like the Odoropa project, we talked a lot about smells as heritage and like the smells that are very important to a certain identity or a certain culture. What do you think about this in terms of like analyzing environmental smells and smells that y- you may experience maybe in a factory or in, in a farm? What do you think of these being considered maybe heritage to some people? I think it's perfectly fascinating and appropriate. <laughs> I mean, just the way objects and sounds are part of the way that we capture our heritage, there is absolutely no reason not to embrace odors as a way of recapitulating a particular historic era. When I've had the opportunity to work with some artists on exhibitions where odors need to be, or odors are desired to be part of the sensory experience, Having a history of the site or what we're trying to achieve is critical to making something that that is bigger than just, you know, putting an odor in an environment, but really bringing a passage of time back to life in the present. And odors can do that better than any other sensory system that we know. So it's absolutely wonderful. (laughs) And is there any smell out there that you've experienced that you think, okay, we should try to capture this? I tend to be pretty agnostic on the good, bad smell side. I mean, to me, smells are just, they're my medium that I work in, that I experience and that sort of thing. So, I mean, I grew up on barrier islands. And so the smell both of the ocean, which has, you know, sort of a funky salinity smell. And also because we have the bay with all of the anaerobic digestion of the, you know, in the mud, you know, those two smells to me speak of, a home and and a comfort and a nurturing. And that's true for many people, you know, that haven't maybe experienced that in years and they'll drive down to an area and get a whiff of that. And suddenly they, you know, they start remembering all sorts of things about things that happened 20, 40, 50 years ago. So it's a wonderful way into not just a cultural heritage, but one's own sense of history that can be revived by smell. Thank you for that answer. 